I'm Jay Spanks. Thanks for tuning in to episode two of Dukes One On One. I'm here with uh, BJ Montero, senior forward of Duquesne men's basketball team. Uh, BJ, uh, newest member of the 1,000 Point Club. That's got to be an amazing milestone in your career. Can you uh, explain to us what that feeling is like? Oh, it's definitely a great feeling. Um, there's been a lot of great players that came to Duquesne and played here. Um, it's just an honor to be a part of that club. Uh, holding on to my uh, guards, finding me, and giving me a lot of easy buckets throughout my career. BJ, uh, you want to clear up the room so everybody uh, likes to say we look alike? You want to go ahead and address that for everyone? Um, you do look like my little brother a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> um, you know, I, I'm not. I'm not mad about the room, you know, Jay Spinks is a, is a handsome guy, you know what I mean? And the girls seem to think I'm handsome too, so, you know, I'm not worried about it. BJ, throughout your career, you've done a lot of great things on the court. Uh, can you explain to us what your future aspirations are post-graduation? Uh, I plan on playing basketball as long as I can, definitely. But um, when my time's up, I want to get into some coaching, doing things with the kids and, you know, throughout my community back home in Connecticut. I just want to you know, help the rec centers and things like that. Get involved with kids and coaching is my biggest aspiration at college. You've had a lot of accomplishments and achievements thus far in your career. Can you explain to us the hard work and, and dedication that goes into making it up? Um, it takes a lot of hard work and dedication. Uh, I've done a lot throughout the summers and throughout the off season to get better, work on my game, get stronger in the weight room. And, you know, I think a lot of people don't see the hard work, but, you know, when you see that improvement season to season, you know, you can tell that a person's been working hard and all Yeah. BJ, in this part of the show is called the five and five, which means you have five seconds to answer each of the five questions. And we start now. Um, question number one, who's the biggest clown on the team? Um, I'm going to go with Jerry Jones. <laughs> question number two, um, who's the best dancer on the team? Andre. Andre who? All right. Question number three, who's the trendiest dresser on the team? I can't pick me, right? <laughs> um, I'll go with Eric Evans. Was that five? Eric Evans. All right. Question number four, who plays the most pranks on the weight trips? TJ McConnell. Question number five, last question, who's the most likely to fall asleep in team meetings? Uh, uh, PJ Torres. <laughs> <laughs> Lastly, BJ, what advice would you give to someone aspiring to play collegiate basketball? I would tell them just be ready to work um, and just be ready to be coached. There's, every coach in America, I believe, is a tough coach. And um, you just got to listen to what they say, not how they say it. Coach Everhart has been on me since I got here. And, you know, I had trouble with it in the beginning when I was a freshman and things like that. But, now that I'm a senior, I just seen what he wanted from me, and you know I could see the growth in me as a player just just from being coached. Really well. Dukes fans, thanks for tuning in to episode two of Dukes One on One. I'm BJ Montero. This guy is Jay Stinks. <laughs> Have a good one. Talk, talk, talk to me, yeah.